In this episode of the Atlanta Maker, we build a wasteboard for the Inventables X-Carve CNC machine. Due to shipping costs, I decided against ordering a wasteboard with my X-Carve kit. Luckily, Inventables has an engineering diagram on their website to guide us in creating our own. I've included a link to the diagram in the video description. First I needed to cut the 3 quarter inch MDF down to its final size. Then I proceeded to draw the main grid for the threaded inserts. I just used a pencil and a short T-square I had laying around to complete the grid. Using a punch and a hammer, I created a divot to prevent the drill bit from wandering. I then proceeded to drill the 144 holes. After flipping the board over, every one of those holes needs a countersink. I got this bit for 99 cents at Harbor Freight and it worked out very nicely. Now each of those holes needs a threaded insert screwed into them. I was dreading this part, but it wasn't too bad after all. The two holes in the middle of the board are fairly simple, being just a single through hole and a big countersink. I wasn't exactly sure how I was going to tackle the holes around the outside that attach the wasteboard to the frame, but in the end it was fairly simple. First, drill a pilot hole. Then, using a Forstner bit, drill down about 5 millimeters. This was about halfway down on the bit I used. Then, using a square, I drew a line from the edge of the circle to the edge of the board. Using a chisel, I removed the wood in this area. I then drilled the hole to its final size and using a coping saw created a slot all the way to the hole we just drilled. All that was left to do was to round the corners over. I found a cap from a bottle that was approximately the size called for in the diagram and drew a line. I then used a sander until I matched the line. The wasteboard is now complete and ready to be installed on the X card. It turned out great and saved me about $200 for ordering the board with the kit. If you like this video, please hit the like button and consider subscribing to my channel for more makeup videos. Thanks for watching.